We all know some martial arts incorporate dance. In fact, some of them can be classified as only dance. But this one took it to the extreme on both levels. It's like a mixture of Irish dancing, ballroom dancing, and drunken vodka dancing. Of course, it comes out of Russia. I want to do ballerina dancing. I failed ballerina school, so I will become a sambo ballerina fighter. Suka. So, let me us know if you want to learn this type of dancing. Would you learn this type Would you learn this type of dancing? The moves seem pretty limber and he seems to have a lot of combos and he seems to have very good lateral movement. What do you think, guys? Is this the ultimate martial arts? Can this beat MMA? Can this beat Sambo? Can this beat Wing Chun? Can this beat Jiu Jitsu? Leave a comment. So now, we have a Chi Master, the blonde dude on the right, who thinks he can destroy this martial artist with his Chi. So they will test out their technique. He is... Oh, okay. It looks like our Chi Master is working. His hypnosis is working. Oh no, but now our martial artist has wised up that uppercut deck out 80% of the Chi Master's Chi Mana. Alright, with only 20% Chi Mana left, let us see if the Martial Arts Master can beat this Chi Master. Boo! He's going again. Martial Art Master, is he feeling the effects? Boom! I don't think he's feeling the effects. Ouch! Those punches connected. Our Chi Master is on the ground. But he doesn't give up. He still has 1% Chi Mana left. Never mind, he gave up. So this host asked Jet Li, she said, is Wusu just nothing but like dancing? And Jet Li's like, yeah, it's nothing but dancing. Look, after the country got created as in communist China, they turned Kung Fu into just a little bit of a performance art. Um, they didn't want people fighting, turning it lethal. So it's just, so, and Jet Li says, you know, even MMA, that kind of sparring type of fight, it still has rules, right? So, host is asking, look, Kung Fu is just for the sake of performing. And so what is real Kung Fu, Jet Li says? That's, what's the quickest way to kill someone? Look, in the old days, you would learn Kung Fu. Ten years, you would learn some technique and you'd be able to kill someone, right? Oh, it's like nowadays, people study for ten years to get a job. Well, back in the old days, you know, for the sake of potentially getting a career, you get this skill, the skill of Kung Fu, and you'd be able to become a person who guards the emperor, or a person who guards someone's home, or something. You know, this is different time period of life. This is what you need, the skills you need. So, nowadays, if you, 10 years and you learn something that can kill someone, you're fucking in jail. 